In this video, we're taking a look at the two-shot AMR9 class. And if this is a phenomenal build, if you're looking to shake up the meta, I was able to drop two nukes. I know for a fact you guys can go crazy as well. So if you guys enjoy, feel free, drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, turn those post notifications. Let's get into it. All right, let's go ahead and create the new absolute best and fastest killing AMR9 class set. This is a perfect SMG to use if you're trying to shake up the SMG meta. Now, for the first attachment, we are starting off with the conversion kit. The Jack Eden double barrel is going to be a great attachment here, essentially transforming the AMR9 into a two shot SMG. Every time you pull the trigger, two bullets come out at the same time, allowing us to dominate at close ranges. If you're trying to destroy other SMG players as well as shotgun users, run this immediately what we're also going to be doing with this class setup is running an underbarrel and i highly recommend running the ftech msp 98 hand stop not only to smooth out that recoil pattern but also bump up that close to medium range performance with that increased movement speed aim walking speed vertical recoil control as well as gun kick control this is a fantastic attachment to run on the air 9 when you are running the conversion kit now, because the conversion kit blocks the barrel as well as the muzzle, we're going to jump right over to the optic and the jack glassless is very important to run because not only are we getting a clean optic picture, we also are going to be improving our firing aiming stability, which is going to be very important with a weapon that fires two bullets at the same time. And we're also going to be reducing that visual recoil again, very important for a weapon that fires two bullets at the same time. This is going to keep us under control and on target at those mean longer ranges just in case you do get into those gunfights now we are going to be running a stock on this build and i highly recommend running the wolfhound carbine stock this is going to be a great attachment to jack up that medium range performance as well as long range with that improved gun kit control as well as recoil control this is going to be a great attachment to run on the double barrel conversion the cons are going to be completely irrelevant do not sleep on this it's going to make a world of difference especially at those medium to longer ranges and because we are going to be firing two bullets at the same time, a magazine is mandatory on this build. And we're just going to go ahead and extend it with the 50 round mag. We don't need the 100 round drum here. We still want to be mobile. This is going to be your best option when trying to dispatch more than one player at the same time when running the AMR9 with the conversion kit. Once you jump into the firing range, you're going to see here that we are going to have a build that even though we have a lot of recoil controlling attachments, we have a relatively quick ADS. And this is going to be a very nice SMG to use, especially at those close to medium ranges. It's going to be annihilating players, believe that. Now, for the remainder of the setup, we are going to be taking a look at the Core 45 with its conversion kit, essentially transforming this into a submachine gun. We have on the 40 round drum, we are utilizing the SO Skeletal Vertical Grip. We're going to be running the Colossus Suppressor XS version for more recoil control. And we do have on the Dynamic Precision Stock, courtesy of the conversion kit, increasing our recoil as well as gun kit control as well. Do not forget to rock munitions box, scavenger gloves, covert sneakers, bone conduction headset to hear footsteps and gunfire a lot easier, ghost TV camera to keep us off the radar, and the comms vest to go ahead and allow us to see people that are in our general vicinity every time we kill somebody and run over their body. I'm really curious to see how some of the other vests are going to play out here in season three because we're in the street is we are getting quick fix. Overall, a great class setup. Do not sleep on the AMR9. This is going to be a fantastic SMG to use right now as well in Season 3. So if you guys enjoy, feel free. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel. Turn those post notifications. I dropped two nukes. Let's get into it. All right. Let's get busy with the double barrel AMR9. The two-shot AMR9. I actually really do enjoy this. After they went ahead and fixed it, it is a really enjoyable submachine gun to rock. Where are these boys at, man? Oh, shit. That guy's lost in the sauce. Nice. Rotate this way. Where the hell are these guys at? Target area updated. Move to the hard point. 
Do a little flank over here. This is probably not the best map to rock a submachine gun on, just for the fact that the spawns are just not the best, but. Tima, you go first. Nobody over there. Come on, it has a portable radar. That's actually really smart to put that there. Hell yeah. Hold on, this WSB swarm setup I picked up is... EMP. I'm gonna actually call it in right now. They're waiting around. Rotate this way. Dude, this uh, WSP swarm that I picked up, th yo, this is about the second time I've picked up a submachine gun that looks like it has a bunk class on it, but it, yo, that's a terrible spawn for you, brother. But it's actually pretty good. Like I picked up that P90 a couple days ago and that was literally hitting. Go ahead and drop this. All right, the spawns have done the flip. Oh, I'm dead. Nope, not today. Oh shit, he dropped on a portable mine. GG with that SAE. Are you serious? Oh no. Oh no. I'm dead. Teammate, get away from me, dog. Yes, because I need the... There we go. Oh my god.
Rotate this way. Spawn should definitely have flipped. That WSP swarm setup. I'm gonna have to go ahead and revisit that shit. I'll tell you that right now. Nice teammate. Dude, how many stuns do these fellas got? Like, You're kidding me, right? You're kidding me, right? Oh, okay, never mind. That's fair. I was about to say, there's no way that guy was just hiding in grass the entire time. Got your back. Mission time is half over. Maintain the lead. Enemies inside the perimeter. Cross it over here. Honestly, like, I really cannot stand the combat knife at all. I cannot stand the combat knife. I'm there about to add another one in here for season three. A guardian? Oh my gosh. Nice. Honest with you, I really I'm not opposed to them going ahead and getting some hill time. I'm dead. Yep, I'm done. I'm done. Bro, as soon as dude, it's like the kid is the kid cannot win gunfights with his with his TAC 56. So his best option is to pull the comp, dude, because I had no ammo. Your best option is to pull the combat knife out. And that happens all the time on this game. Go to the next one. No, the game's over, bro. I'm gonna let this guy think he won the game for his team. I'm gonna let them get, if it's possible, I'm letting them get to 245. Just so they know that their efforts were a complete waste.
I want them to know they got nuked. busy with the air bar nine on sub base definitely a fun map to play on i've been getting this a lot recently not complaining one bit because it could be a lot worse but we are getting six maps in season three which is incredibly gas cannot wait for that to drop man hopefully the maps are solid We've taken the lead. looks like we are oh shit looks like we are getting a spear re okay hold on oh what the hell back here jesus that confirming next hard point stand by it's like we're also getting a, a quick fix uh vest as well within season three hold on y'all oh Yo, if he had a, I thought he had a combat knife. I literally got I, my heart dropped. I was like, oh, if he has a combat knife, I am. Oh. This guy has one of the worst MCW setups I've picked up. We've lost the lead. Rotate over here. Dude, what is with these MCW setups? It's not that hard to build a good MCW, fellas. Like, Hard point relocated. Secure the target area. what? Come on, come on, come on. Confirming next hard point, stand by. Hard point compromised. Secure the area. Rotate it this way, they're gonna have to cross. Take that back up. Copy. Longbow three. Hard point compromised. Secure the area. Hard point relocating. Stand by. I see him back there. See the shadow. Oh. My shit just came in clutch. No, no, no. Confirming next 
Be tall. Target area updated. Move to the hard point. Come on, come on, come on. Hard point compromised. Secure the area. Advanced. On a 17. Oh my god. Target area updated. Oh my god. Thank God for the EMP. Oh my god. Let's drop this nuke. That was literally next level clutch and i get i get shot from behind that was next level clutch let's go baby my new got zero kills but it does not matter